And uh, let's talk a little about, you know, the transparency aspect. Yes. Uh, since you said the 4G, and I'm presuming what you're saying is the 4G ULIPs are only sold online, right? These are not offline products. These are, these are largely sold online, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So you could buy them offline, but they are available. everything is available online. What but, but are the same charges applicable offline as well? Sometimes they are more, but in the online products, those charges are much lower. Okay. So, so I'm talking about, see, when I talk about ULIPs, I'm talking about these five, six, seven products hmm. in the industry. Hmm. When, when I talk about the 4G. I'm not talking about which, every... Which hopefully others will follow suit. Which hopefully others will also create yeah. the similar products. Right. So that the consumer benefits. And the 4G ULIP is an online product. It's an online product. For the young for, Indian. For the... Who's comfortable young, transacting old, online. Anybody who's smart who can... Transact uh, you online. Can, who, yeah. who, can, who can rationalize mm. and understand the reality. Mm. Uh, I think it's... No, you've anyway work. simplified a lot of insurance buying, maybe in term, etc. You can your check your NAV. You can check simple. the NAV of the ULIP whenever yeah. you want. Okay. Just like the NAV of a mutual fund. Mm. So there is no problem. Hmm. You can you can check it every day. You can check it like my father likes to check his NAV every day. Okay. I don't know why. That's hmm. the sign of a nervous holder. Hmm. But he does. Hmm. So I think uh, that you can do in a ULIP also if okay. you wish to. So the transparency exists now. Okay. There is no so there is uh, you know where your money is going. You know the portfolio because yeah. there were some concerns that it only covers a certain number of There's stocks a big in advantage. the portfolio. See, Think about it. I don't want to. No, I personally into... feel the lesser you know the better because I no, think no, we get just so worked up let's, about. Let's. We all say one should invest long term. Mm. Who will invest long term? Somebody mm. who has capital available to them for which can't be moved for at least five years mm. or somebody whose capital can move every day. Mm. So typically ULIPs have shown the ability to invest in longer term uh, equities. Mm. Uh, mm. But eventually the fund managers are moving between one and the other. It's the same fund managers that move who are mm. managing mutual funds, who one day are managing a ULIP, who again mm. going back and managing a, uh, a mutual fund. Mm. And you can see who's a higher quality fund manager by looking at the performance of the last five years. Mm. So just like you invest in mutual funds, you compare ULIP performance also. Mm. Nobody's saying don't compare the performance. Look at the past performance, look at the costs. Where the costs are low, performance is high, go for that. Mm. And the flexibility exists. You can move out of it anytime. You can mm. move out of it and move into a debt fund, which will give you your 8% kind of returns anytime. Mm. 